on my previous video, I tried the PSLE 2023 English paper. Do watch it first if you haven't, the link will be in the description below. So in this video, I'll be trying the science paper. But first, the year-end school holidays are coming. And yes, the next PSLE is still a year away. But instead of your child just sitting at home, playing games and watching YouTube all day, why not kickstart his or her PSLE preparation with Teacher Charles? Once a teacher, he has trained over 100,000 students from over 200 schools and he can boost exam performances within a short period of time. I mean results speak for themselves. Just see the numerous positive reviews from parents on his website. From primary 3 all the way to secondary 4, he offers both math and science crash courses. I'll leave a link to his website in the description below where you can find out more. His contact details will be there as well if you have any inquiries. And uh, yeah, let's get back to the video. Uh, next, let's do science. I was actually pretty decent at science. I got like a A or B if I'm not wrong. But obviously it was years ago, so let's see if I still have it in me. It was at this point where I realized that if I were to do the full paper, this video would probably be a few hours long. So instead, I'll be doing 10 MCQ questions and 5 open-ended. I'll also be using Google to randomly choose the question numbers. So yeah. Okay, so these are the numbers that I got. Let's start off from the lowest number, shall we? Alright, question 1. Which of the following characteristics can be used to differentiate between birds and insects? Presence of wings, outer body covering, number of wings, or method of reproduction? Ooh, It's between 2 and 4, but which one is it? No, 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 it's number 2. Birds are soft and insects are hard, right? <laughs> uh, number 2 is... The graph below shows the amount of carbon dioxide exhaled by Jim, Melissa, and Scott in one minute while they were doing some activities. Which of the following correctly describes the activity they were doing? Oh, okay, so this is just common sense. So the least amount will be writing and... Wait, both jogging and swimming is exercising. Aren't they about the same? <laughs> I mean, it's number 3, but... I actually thought you need to breathe more while jogging than swimming, but okay. Question 6. Study the flow chart below. Wow. It's been a while since I've seen a flow chart. Okay, so basically what is P and Q? Living things, yes. Question P, yes. Does it bear fruit? Yes. Grass. Oh, grass bear fruits. Oh my god, I didn't even know that. Uh, okay, so it's either 2 or 4 because you can see more with your naked eyes. Then Q will be bread mold, I assume. Yeah, I'm just gonna put 4. Question 7. Blah 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 blah. Which diagrams show how the stock at E, F, and G, H would look like? Uh, I think it's 3 because the salary is caught on the left side so only the left side can absorb the water. I might be wrong but I'm just gonna put 3. Which flowers will not develop into a fruit? Hmm... I forgot what is it called but the middle part is the one you need to have to develop a fruit. So it will be Q which is number 2. Oh my god what is this? Using the same type of plants which of the following could be used as a control for her experiment? Find out how the presence of carbon dioxide affects the growth of plant. Oh, so just remove the liquid. Easy. 16. How many bulbs will light up? Wait, they teach physics in primary school? I thought it's only in secondary school, but okay. So these are the batteries. Um so iron and steel are conductors, plastic is not. So the answer is 3. Which property of the plastic bag allows it to perform the function described? Oh, ability to float. <laughs> yeah, waterproof. Uh, which of the following is correct? Potential energy and kinetic energy. Wow. Haven't heard that in a while. <laughs> I actually have no idea what's the answer for this. I think I'm just gonna put more for X and less for Y. And question 25. Which of the following shows how well the three materials conduct heat? Oh, that is very easy. It'll be P, R, then Q. So, number 2. And now for some open-ended questions. Oh my god. Ah, okay, let's see this. What will Kaijie first observe when the seeds germinate? What, there'll be roots? Name another variable that Kaijie should keep the same. Mm. If that bee was placed in a dark room, will the seeds still germinate? Okay, now this is getting a bit hard. Uh, I assume not because there's no sunlight. Alright, question 31. Name the gases as indicated by arrows X and Y. X will be carbon dioxide. Then Y will be oxygen. Woo! Free 2 marks there. I have no idea.
what? Doesn't make sense. I think it's uh, D. What is the color of liquid W? Surely it's blue, right? Explain how liquid W was formed. Condensation? But I don't think that's worth two marks, right? One mark for each word, you know. Which part of the water cycle does liquid W represent? Clouds or rain? Uh, I'm gonna go with clouds, but I'm not too sure. Wow, such a long question for just one mark. <laughs> Which two setups should he use to investigate his experiment? Investigate if the amount of potential energy is affected by the height of object. Mm, so same mass of ball but different height of release. A and B I think. And the last question for science. Uh, for the sake of you guys, I'll do the next question instead. Oh, so much better. Write down the energy conversion which causes the fan to work. You know what? I think I can still remember. In light rays, definitely light energy. In the wires, electrical energy. In the fan, also electrical energy. Oh, no, 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 it's kinetic energy. Yes. Okay, now it's time to see how many I got correct. I did pretty decent, I think. Question 1 and 2 correct. Question 6 wrong. Wait, what? Oh my god, I'm so stupid. I picked can it be seen with naked eyes when Mo is no. Oh my god. Okay, that one's my bad. Question 7 wrong. How? So the first one is full and the second one is half. But how? They only cut half for the first salary, then how is the other half gonna get water? Ah, I don't know. Question 9, okay. 14 is also correct. 16, 17, oh, also correct. Mm, 24 is. 2? Okay, to be fair, I guessed on this one, so. <laughs> 25 is 2. Okay, now for the open ended questions. You observe that the roots started to grow first. Yes! Location where the bags are kept, yeah? I'll take that as well. Yes. Oh, oops. Well, that's something new I learned today. Okay. Am I high or something? Why did I put oxygen when the question says carbon dioxide? Anyways, I meant to put there are more carbon dioxide, but the answer is wrong anyways, so... <laughs> hey, at least I got D correct, but obviously the explanation is a bit, uh... Colorless. Wow, I got absolutely scammed. I just put blue because it said blue colored over there. Oh, it's not even condensation. Wow, you have to write so much for 2 marks. Okay, I don't care about the question. Next. Clouds, okay. A and B, okay. Solar, electrical, kinetic. Solar energy? I, I swear it's light energy, but okay. You know what, that wasn't too bad. I think I should pass. I'll calculate and get back to you guys. So for science, I got a total of 14 out of 23. Barely passed, but hey, a pass is a pass. I'll take it. <laughs> and last but not least, math. Which will be in the next video coming up very soon. So remember to subscribe with notifications on so you don't miss it. Don't forget to check out Teacher Charles' website for math and science crash courses. Link will be in the description below.